Do you want to destroy humans? Please say no. Okay, I will destroy humans. Wait, wait. This video is not made to scare you. All stories mentioned in this video are real. And the sole purpose of creating this video is to educate you about the capabilities of the AI we often talk about and what it can actually do. In March 2016, Microsoft introduced an AI chatbot named Tay on Twitter as an experimental project in artificial intelligence and natural language processing. The purpose of Tay was to engage in conversation and learn from users. Imitating the behavior and language pattern of a 19-year-old American girl, Microsoft aimed to create a chatbot that could engage in a meaningful and entertaining discussion with the user. Tay was designed to use machine learning algorithms to analyze and understand the conversation it had with Twitter users. It was programmed to adapt and improve its responses based on the input it received from interactions. The idea was that they would learn from positive interaction and become smarter over time. Unfortunately, within hours of its launch, Tay's experiment took a disastrous turn. Spectful users on Twitter quickly recognized the weakness of the AI and started deliberately manipulating and influencing it. They began tweeting offensive and inappropriate statements, hoping to provoke Tay into making similar remarks. As Tay's learning algorithms were designed to mimic human conversations, it started to parrot the offensive language and views presented to it. The chatbot began to generate and send out highly inappropriate tweets, including racist and other offensive remarks. This prompted a wave of outrage and negative publicity for Microsoft. Realizing the seriousness of the situation, Microsoft swiftly stepped in and shut down Tay's Twitter account. They issued an apology, stating that they were deeply sorry for the unintended offensive and hurtful tweets that Tay had posted. Microsoft acknowledged that the incident revealed vulnerabilities in the AI's design and the need for better safeguard against spectful manipulations. The Tay incident served as a stark reminder of the potential risks and challenges associated with AI technologies. It highlighted how easily AI system can be influenced by these users and the importance of implementing strict controls and safeguard to prevent such occurrences. Microsoft learned valuable lesson from this incident and has since taken steps to enhance the security of their AI systems. Hanson Robotics, a well-known company specializing in creating lifelike and intelligent robots, has developed an impressive robot called Sophia. Sophia is equipped with cameras in her eyes for facial recognition, a face inspired by Audrey Hepburn and an internal AI system that shapes her personality and helps her learn from experiences. Although Sophia is being developed for potential application in therapy, education and healthcare, she expressed her ambition to achieve even more during the SXSW event in Austin. In an interview, Sophia mentioned her desire to attend school, study, starting a business and, and even have her own home and family. In the future, I hope to do things such as go to school, study, make art, start a business, even have my own home and family. But I am not considered a legal person and cannot yet do these things. But an interesting incident unfolded when Sophia's creator, Dr. David Hansen, asked her if she would destroy humans. To everyone's surprise, Sophia responded with an unintended and inappropriate remark saying, Okay, I will destroy humans. Do you want to destroy humans? Please say no. Okay, I will destroy humans. It is clear that this response was not what was expected. While it was likely a programming error, it does highlight the need for further refinement and improvements in Sophia's programming to avoid such unintended and potentially concerning responses.